morning guys it's a Monday morning um, ready to get back into the swing of things um, on support this week this week which really sucks but it uh, goes with the job driving my Cavalier again for the moment um, because the uh, Aveo wound up with a dead battery and after further inspection I believe what happened was one of the children was poking around in there uh, probably on Saturday and left one of the doors partially open so the dome light was on all weekend and uh, so this morning it was deader than a doornail yay speaking of the vehicle stuff um, got the bus out drove it around for uh, the church paper drive today it's using it as a overflow vehicle but uh, <clears throat> when I went to get it out uh, the batteries were dead to start with which was a fun situation trying to jump start a, a freaking uh, big old diesel engine uh, did get it running though uh, once it was running I realized that the uh, temperature gauge wasn't working so I'm like oh that's wonderful that's another thing I gotta fix and then uh, while I was trying to get it out of the driveway uh, I got it stuck in the yard so yeah I just had all kinds of fun with the bus this weekend um, was able to get it out although I pretty much obliterated that uh, section of the yard the edge of the driveway there um, does anyone else ever have these dreams where uh, you find something really, really cool. I mean, it could be like a, a treasure or something that you just never noticed before, and it's like, wow, this is amazing. And you go to show it to everybody, and then after everybody's not impressed, you realize that it's like fake or it's, you know, chintzy or decorative or something like that, and it's not anywhere near as cool as you thought it was. I have those dreams all the time. What, uh, dream interpreter would have to say about that. My second oldest son uh, had his uh, confirmation this past weekend. Um, for those of you who aren't Catholic, that's a Catholic thing. Uh, we went to eat at Golden Corral, which is one of my favorite feeding troughs. Uh, had a bunch of steak and seafood and stuff like that. Uh, might as well get your money's worth when it's a buffet like that. But, uh, that was an uh, excellent meal. Very, very tasty. One of my co-workers and uh, friends is uh, opening a brewery in uh, Mansfield. They're getting ready to open the doors. They've just had their like uh, soft opening or founders get together or what the heck ever you want to call it this past weekend. Um, looking forward to checking out uh, what kind of uh, drinks they've got available, but uh, the location is going to be called uh, the Phoenix Brewing Company, and it's actually the building is an old Undertaker's establishment, so it's got a lot of uh, crazy history and stuff like that. So, be interested in uh, taking the tour and uh, sampling the brew. I think that's going to be it. Everybody have a good week. Thanks for uh, liking and sharing and commenting on this uh, video. Thanks for subscribing to my YouTube channel. And as always, thanks for watching my damn video.